Amen. Let's give God praise today. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God, we honor you, Father. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, God, we magnify you today, God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Come on, let's just give him praise this afternoon. Thank you, Jesus. You are worthy, God, and worthy of the praise. Hallelujah. Oh, God, we thank you. Um, I'm feeling a word of knowledge. Somebody has pain on their left knee, and I speak healing over you now in the name of Jesus. I don't know who that is, but I feel somebody have pain in the left knee. I uh, command the stiffness to leave right now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, God. We thank you, God, for supernatural healing to manifest. God, we just repent of our sins, oh, God. We humble ourselves, oh, God, and we just magnify you, Lord. You said the two or three gathered. Oh, Lord, you are in the midst. So, God, we thank you, God, that you are in the midst yeah. today in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, God, we just lay every burden at the altar today. We lay every burden at the altar right now. Some of us came on here heavy. Some of us came on here feeling depressed. I come against that now in the name of Jesus. Some of us are in our emotions. I come against that now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I just ask you, Lord, for supernatural strength, oh, God, to make it on our journey. Some of us are crying out. You're saying, God, I don't know how I'm going to make it. Oh, God, I just feel like this is too much pressure on me, but I got a word. Amen. God is just taking you through, taking you through the crushing process to get the oil out of you. Amen. There's a greater level of anointing coming upon your life. This is a, God is increasing your territory, so just hold on. Hold on just a little while longer. Oh, God, give us wisdom, God. Give us discernment, Lord, in the name of Jesus. God, some of us are just frustrated. Lord God, so I just ask you, God, to remove that, that frustration from each and every one of us right now in the name of Jesus. Some of us feel some kind of way because you're waiting for the, the promises of the Lord to manifest and we come against uh, just just getting tired and anxious. In Jesus' name, the word of God tells us not to be anxious about anything. But by everything in prayer and supplication, we're going to present our request to God and the peace that surpasses all understanding will guard our hearts and minds through Jesus Christ. So, God, we thank you. Hallelujah. I feel somebody on here, you have pain in the left side of your, your lower back. You know, you've been dealing with this for a while, and I decree and declare healing to manifest upon you right now in Jesus' name. And, God, we thank you that by your stripes they are healed, Lord, in Jesus' name. Oh, God, you tell us in Psalm thirty-four, seventeen, verse 20, when the righteous cry out for help, you hear and you deliver us out of all our troubles. You say you are near to the brokenhearted, and you save those who are crushed in spirit, God. You tell us in your word that many are the afflictions of the righteous, but you deliver us out of them all. So, God, we thank you, God, that you will demonstrate your word in our lives right now. Some of us are feeling heavy. Some of us feel depressed. I don't, I don't know what you're going through, but the Lord knows. And God, I thank you, Lord God, that you're going to perfect the things that are concerning us. Oh God, I pray that you restore marriages. Lord, I pray that you open up the heavens over our lives so we get, so we can get uh, jobs and better jobs. In the name of Jesus, oh God, I decree and declare favor that we'll walk in favor. Oh God, some of us got ideas, Lord. We have ideas, God, and we don't know how to put it together, oh, God. We don't know how to uh, make this thing go into fruition. So, God, I just ask you for supernatural help, God, to bless our ideas to come alive, to bless our ideas, oh, God, to prosper in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you, God, for giving us supernatural energy to perform our daily tasks, oh, God, on the things that we're called to do. Some of us, we have so many assignments over over our lives, and we have not even tapped into what God has for us. But I decree and declare God's going to give us supernatural strength to complete every task in the name of Jesus. Some of us are entrepreneurs. Some of us are authors. Some of us, uh, you, you, your supervisors, managers, whatever you're doing, amen, lay members, amen, whatever you're called to do, I decree and declare we're going to walk in a spirit of excellence in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I feel this thing. I feel like God wants to heal, amen. So I'm going to flow with him today, amen. Uh, somebody on here, I don't know who you are, but I'm just going to unmute 
someone is having pain in their left leg. It's throbbing really bad. I don't know who that is. If that's you, just come forward right now. God wants to heal. Someone, you have a pain in your left leg. It's throbbing. It's the left side of your leg. I feel it in my bones in the front of my shin area. Come on, just come forward so I can move on. It's the it's the left side of your leg. It's in, it's in the shin area on your bone. It's throbbing. Sometimes it feels like your left your left leg is going numb. Who is that? If you're muted, push start six. Okay. I feel I feel this so strong. I'm trying to I'm trying to pray, but I keep feeling this pain in my leg. I'm being obedient to the Holy Spirit. I don't know who you are on here, but I seek healing in Jesus' name. It's interrupting my the, the prayers. And now I don't know who that is. Oh God, I thank you, God, for healing right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord. We thank you, Father God, Lord, that you can bless us to be excited about the things that we're called to do. Some of us lost our our zeal. Some of us lost our excitement for what we're called to do. Some of us started off happy and just excited, but along the way we lost the excitement. But, God, I pray that we will not lose our excitement in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I decree and declare that whatever we're doing, we're going to do unto you and not unto men. Some of us want to focus. We, we thought it was all about the pastor, the prophet, the apostle, but we didn't realize what we're doing. We're doing it unto the Lord, and we need to do it unto the Lord. So, God, I decree and declare that whatever we put our hands to, we will prosper in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you, God, for opening up a door that no man can shut. I don't care who's praying against us and trying to curse us. I decree and declare that when God opens up this door, no one can shut it. In the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you that the joy of the Lord is our strength. Somebody needs to know that the joy of the Lord is your strength. And then when you feel weak, when you feel discouraged, that God is going to give you supernatural joy to hold on. Lord, you said anxiety in a man's heart weighs it down, but a good word cheers us up. So, God, I just come against anxiety. God, I come against depression. I come against heaviness right now in the name of Jesus. I'm telling you guys, if you're feeling heavy today, just say, God, here, I'm putting this on the altar. Lord, I'm, I'm giving this to you, Lord. I don't want to be heavy laden anymore. I don't want to be burdened, Lord God, by the cares of this life anymore. So I just give it to you. Lord, I know everything's going to work out for my good. That needs to be your daily decree. Amen. That everything's going to work out for your good. They rejected you. I thank God because God has something better in store for each and every one of us. Amen. God, I thank you, Lord God, just for the setbacks because, Lord, you are preparing us for a greater comeback, Lord. So, God, I thank you, Father God. We're doing a great work in each and every one of our lives. In the name of Jesus, God, I thank you for the provision. God, I thank you, God, for the turnarounds, God. God, I thank you, Father God, for the deliverance in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, we just cancel every demonic attack against us. We cancel confusion on our minds. We cancel witchcraft attacks in the name of Jesus. We cancel the terror of the night in the name of Jesus that will try to come in and uh, try to cause us to have nightmares. Spirits, we cancel, Lord God, just attacks right now on our bodies in the name of Jesus. Even right now, I don't know who you are, but I'm feeling someone. Your it's your right ear. It's clogged or something. Something's going on in your right ear. I don't know who you are, but you're being healed right now. I still feel this person. Nobody came forward. Amen. But when I call this out, someone's left leg. Um, I feel the pain easing up right now. I couldn't even. I couldn't even focus. I couldn't. I couldn't even pray that well. Amen. Because I kept feeling this pain in my left shin area in the front of my leg. Amen. Um, God is healing that right now. And then somebody else on the left side of your lower back. Uh, 
it's been causing you pain, uh, God is healing that too in the name of Jesus. And God, I thank you, Father God, for setting us free. We cancel. We stand in the gap. We cancel every plot and plan uh, of uh, the enemy against our lives in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, we pray a hedge of protection around us, God, as we travel. We pray a hedge of protection around us, God. Oh, God, throughout our day, in the name of Jesus, oh, God, cover our children, cover our future children, cover our spouses. Lord, God, cover the people that's connected to us now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you, Father God. Oh, God, yes, you're doing a good work in us. I thank you that our soul finds rest in you alone because our hope comes from you. God, we're going to, Lord, we're going to be sober and diligent because we have a, the enemy that's uh, roaring around like a, a lion seeking whom he may devour. Lord God, so we thank you, Father God, that we are going to stay on our post. We're not going to be caught slipping. Oh, God, I thank you for the, the, the burden of prayer and the burden of intercession. God, I thank you that we're going to be faithful in the small things, oh, God. So when you bless us for greater, we can be faithful in the large things. And I want to encourage somebody today to tell you do not, do not, do not despise small beginnings. Do not despise the small things right now in your life because God is doing a major thing in your life. He's doing a major thing in each and every, every one of our lives. Keep on going. Keep on going. Amen. God, give us wisdom, oh God, Lord, on how to minister. Give us wisdom, oh God, on how to respond. Give us wisdom, oh God, on how to be successful in each and every areas of our lives. In the name of Jesus, I feel someone you have a major headache in the front. Uh, it's kind of like by your eyes in the front of your head. Amen. And we come against that pain and uh, headache pain right now in Jesus' name. We break it off right now in the name of Jesus. I hear hypertension in the spirit. We come against high blood pressure now in the name of Jesus, and we command uh, this blood pressure to be normal right now in the name of Jesus. I see someone on here. You've been having problems like with your breathing. Uh, you, you're Maybe it's asthma. Uh, you're taking inhalers. You have to, sometimes you got to take breathing treatments, and God is healing you right now. Amen. You're going to notice that you don't even have to take your daily dose of uh, this inhaler or your albuterol treatment or your Ventolin treatment or whatever you take. You don't even have to take that anymore in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Lord, I got to thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. And somebody right now, uh, I see someone that has a, a you face a great loss. Uh, I feel like maybe you're a widow or something. I see a widow in the spirit, uh, and, and God's bringing you healing. Amen. I don't know uh, if somebody's on here. You, you face a loss. Uh, maybe your your spouse uh, passed, um, and you, you 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 are just grieving, and God is bringing you healing in your heart. In the name of Jesus, oh, God, I just ask you, God, to keep each and every one of us right now in the name of Jesus. And even right now, somebody is concerned and saying, God, I know you've given me this vision to start this organization, and I just need wisdom, God. I'm frustrated. I feel like I hit a wall. I just don't know what to do. And God is downloading right now a strategy. He's going to give you even Favor, he says, if you seek my face and get in a posture that's broken before me, then I'm the God that's going to make provision for you. I'm the God that's going to make a way for you. Hallelujah. I don't know who that's for. Amen. But it's a concern on your uh, your heart. Uh, God, I thank you, Father God, that you will bless us, God, to have an attitude of, of thanksgiving, God. Hallelujah. And, God, I also lift up the people right now that are working jobs, God, but they're they're having a lot of warfare on these jobs. God, I decree and declare that their jobs will be an atmosphere of peace. God, I pray that these coworkers that we may be working with on a daily basis, I pray that they'll get saved and delivered in the name of Jesus. God, I pray that you will draw them nigh to you in the name of Jesus. We come against injustice on the job. Some of us are working jobs that uh the supervisor has favoritism, uh, showing favoritism towards coworkers. Uh, there's a lot of unfair rules in the workplace. It's very hard and it's a stressful environment for you. But we're believing and we're going to touch and agree today that God is going to cause a breakthrough on your job in the name of Jesus. 
Lord God, I pray right now for the people that's on fixed incomes, God. Oh, God, that you could make a way. Some of us on fixed incomes, we don't have uh, enough money, amen, to do certain things or to do more things that we want to do for the kingdom or just to get around. I, I speak an increase in each and every one of our lives in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you, Lord, that you are a refuge and a stronghold. Lord, a very present help in the time of need. God, I thank you that you are a lamp and you will turn our darkness, God, into light in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you, God, that you will keep us in perfect peace because our mind is stayed upon you. God, we trust you. Lord, God, I thank you, Father God. Hallelujah. Wherever we go, God, you go. God, I thank you for enlarging our territory in the name of Jesus. God, I pray right now just for uh, great jobs with great benefits, God. For those, somebody on here believing for workers' comp, God, I speak a release of that. In the name of Jesus, God, give, give them favor uh, and, and release the things that's been held up, God. God, we call forth the uh, job with great benefits. God, for those that believe in for promotions on the job, God, I decree and declare that you will bless us with promotions because Promotion doesn't come from men, but it comes from you. So, God, we thank you, Lord, we choose to believe that today. God, I decree and declare that you're going to take care of every problem that we face in our lives, our life, God, especially on our work environments. God, I thank you, Lord, that we don't have to fall apart, but we're going to wait on you. God, you're going to renew our strength, and we're going to mount up with wings as eagles. We're going to run and not be weary. We're going to walk and not faint. God, I thank you, Father God that we're, we're going to walk in the overflow, we're going to walk in the abundance. In the name of Jesus, you said money answers all things. So, God, I thank you for the provision. You said, God, you daily load us, God, with benefits. So, God, I thank you, God, for daily loading us with benefits in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you that you are our everlasting strength. God, I thank you that your everlasting joy will crown each and every one of our heads, God. God, I thank you that your gladness and your joy will overtake us. And God, any sorrow that we're uh, feeling, Lord, God, it has to flee right now in the name of Jesus. Some of us have been heavy. Some of us have been just in the valley of decisions, and you're saying, God, i got to make a, a critical choice, and I just don't know which way to go. God, I pray right now for clarity. I pray right now for clarity in the name of Jesus. Somebody saying, God, I, I want to leave my spouse. I pray, I decree and declare, hallelujah, just that God will restore your marriage. Amen. God hates divorce. And, I, and, and no situation is too hard for God. Nothing is too hard for God in the name of Jesus. I see, uh, I see a, a child, uh, this child that I see is having, uh, chronic, uh, earaches or, uh, ear infections. I don't know if you're the mother or the grandparent. Um, ooh, gee, I feel anointing on this word. Mm. And God's gonna put an end to this chronic, uh, ear infections. This is a revolving thing, it keeps happening, happening. And I don't know who you are on this line, but God's gonna touch this child where this child was getting uh, this earaches and these ear infections, God is going to heal this child right now in the name of Jesus. So, God, I thank you, Father God. I thank you, Lord, that you are making a way right now. Lord, God, I pray for the people that's having a hard time to get a job. God, we call forth the jobs and the employment opportunities now. God, I pray for the people that's working minimum wage jobs and are working jobs that's not enough to cover the bills. God, I thank you for increase in their lives right now in the name of Jesus. God, some of us, we got plans and uh, visions that we need uh, financing for. God, I decree and declare that you will finance each and every one of our visions in the name of Jesus. Some of us got events that we got to do, but we don't have the money for it. We call forth the money to finance our, our, our conferences, our ministries, everything that we set our hands to in the name of Jesus. Amen. We are children of the Most High God, and we come against the spirit of lack right now in the name of Jesus. I know sometimes it may get difficult, but it's not too hard for God. It may be impossible with us, but it's not too hard for God in the name of Jesus. And I feel someone else on here. You're having uh, just uh, your, your mystical prints are just they're not they're they're harsher than the average woman amen and god is delivering you from these harsh cramps that you feel 
And God is healing that wound right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, I thank you, God, for healing in the wound right now in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you, God. Lord, and somebody else on here, I don't know who you are, but you believe in God for conception. You just pray and say, God, I want twins. I see twins in the spirit. If you just lay hands on your belly or lay hands, excuse me, on your wound, amen, as a point of contact, Lord, I command the spirit of bareness to lick and break off of her life. Lord God, and I speak to her her wound. I command her wound to be fruitful and multiplied now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you, Father God, for conception in the name of Jesus. I don't know who you are, but I see I see twins in the spirit in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Come on, let's, let's give God praise today. Amen. I, I feel uh, a lot of words of knowledge upon me right now. Amen. And I'm going to open up the line after we give God praise just for confirmation. Amen. Because I'm uh, feeling this thing. Hallelujah. So come on, let's open up our mouth today. And let's give God praise. Amen. Hi, God. Hallelujah. God, we thank you. God, we honor you, Jesus. Oh, God, we reverence you. Hallelujah. Come on, let's give him praise today. Amen. I break this resistance off this line today. Come on, let's give him praise today. Come on, let's open up our mouth today. Amen. Come on, let's press in. Let's press in. Let's press in. Come on, let's walk in expectancy today. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, we can't stay small. We can't stay in that hard place. Yes, Lord. Come on, God has so much more for us. Hallelujah, Jesus. In the name of Jesus, He has so much more for us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, your God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Praise me, God. Hallelujah, Hallelujah Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the holy name of God. Bless Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. Now we magnify you. We praise you. Oh, how we glorify you. Yes, Lord. Lord. Worthy, Jesus. Hallelujah. Bless the name of the Lord, oh God. Bless the name of the Lord. Thank you, God. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. God, I thank you, God, for your vision. God, we thank you, God, for joy. God, we thank you, God, for strength. God, we thank you, God, for life. God, we thank you, God, for your presence. We thank you, God, for joy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We thank you, God, for making yes, a way out of no way. We thank you, God, for increase. Hallelujah. We thank you, God, for yes. all. We thank you, God, for victory. Hallelujah. We thank you, God, for healing. Thank you. God. Thank you, 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 God. Oh, we worship yeah. God. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, God. We thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, L
Hello, this is your line. Can you hear me? Uh, I can hear you somewhat, yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, you called out about the uh, uh, menstrual cramp because I just had that procedure last night, and I just got out of the um, hospital this morning, and that's one of the um, effects of it uh, is mm, having severe okay. cramps. So um, I definitely feel a lot better. Amen. Thank you, God. Amen. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. God, we thank you, God, for your love. Yeah. God bless her from her head down to her feet. Bless her, God. And God, I bless thank God. you, Jesus. Lord God, we commend yeah. every pain and every residue to come up out. Yeah. In Jesus' name, we seek a speedy recovery yeah. right now yeah. of the surgery in the name of Jesus. Yeah. We bind up any post-op complications right now uh, in the name of Jesus. And God, I pray that you touch her right now, God, and we cancel every demonic attack against her right now in the name of Jesus, and we decree and declare a blessing upon our household right now. In Jesus' mighty right name, amen. 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 Who else? If I caught out something concerning you. Prophet, this is the answer. Uh, the organization, uh, you called that out. I'm, the Lord gave me an idea, and it just seems like I'm not getting the funding or um, the support um, as I pushed it out. You call that out, and also feeling heavy and depressed. Amen. Amen. Let's let's touch and agree. Amen. The backlash for about a week straight. Amen. And I had to take my communion every day and just confess and break it off of me and fast and break that off of me. And then yeah. shortly after that. You know, the Lord took me to another level uh, in, in the spirit, and he began to open up my eyes. He said, I want you to do uh, like a seven-day fast. So I did a seven-day fast, and he said, you're going to begin to walk in unusual miracles. And when I was leaving and breaking off that fast, I decided, okay, God, I'm going to end this fast in prayer. Then the Lord began to open up my eyes, and I seen Jesus uh, he spit out a mouthful of blood. Somebody slapped him, and he spit out mm-hmm. blood on the ground. Mm-hmm. And then I was like, oh, my God, you know, because my eyes were open in the spirit. Mm-hmm. And then I looked down, and it was his skin on my skin, his bloody skin on my skin. I'm like, what? And it shook me up because it felt so real. And then I looked up at Jesus, and he was he was cleansed up. He wasn't bloody. And he threw a golden cloak on me, a golden cloak. And I have not had backlash since that day. Amen. So you have to, I don't know why I'm saying that, but I just feel his anointing. Amen. Oh, Jesus. God is taking to another level. Yes. You got to push past that backlash because yes. the enemy knows when you write this book, mm. so many people's lives are going to get changed and Thank you're going to impact so many lives. My God. You're going to write this book, and yes. I decree and declare an anointing to get it done in a timely manner. There has been a significant delay concerning yes. this book, but we come against that delay right now in the name of Jesus, and we speak life upon this. We yes. I speak an acceleration that yes. God will redeem the time for you. You know, mm. you should have been done with this book. I speak an acceleration. Mm. You'll sit down and get the book done in no time. Yes. Amen. Amen. I decreed in your life impartation. I seek yeah. an acceleration for this book. For anyone on here that want to write a book quickly, I'm talking about you write a book in like five hours. I wrote one of my books in five hours. Amen. Yeah. I speak that in your life. Amen. I speak in your life that you'll be able to get a book done in a month. Uh, I'm talking about a like 20,000 uh, word book uh, in a month. Uh, and she says, I decree it so. Yes. Amen. I feel uh, the, the 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 anointing on that word. Amen. Yes. I just come against any hesitation, any procrastination on each and every one of our lives. Yes. Lord, I thank you, God, for your fire. In yes. Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, yes. Amen. You guys be encouraged. Who else got uh, something called out for you today? <laughs> if anything was said, that was for you. Hey, prophetess. Um, hey. This is uh, how you doing today? Good. Uh, today you had I came in towards the middle of the call, so I missed like uh, some of it because I'm at work. But I wanted to say this because um, several things you said today kind of like the the organization and stuff things. And but yesterday you said something, and I really wanted to 
say this because this is amazing to me. You talk about God restoring relationships, a family, and and friends. And yesterday was my mom's birthday. I reached out to call my mom, and when I called my mom, my sister, who's my middle, who's a younger sister, who I haven't talked to in seven, maybe ten years. I was talking to my mom, and my mom, uh, mom, she asked my mom who she was talking to, and my mom said, your sister V. Then she said she didn't say nothing. And because I'm free and I don't have anything holding me back, I was like, oh, tell her hi, tell her I love her, tell her this. And then she actually came and talked to me. Like, I haven't talked to her in years. You know what I'm saying? Wow. And, and immediately when I got off the phone, God asked me what you prayed about God restoring relationships, and I was like, because I never even knew what, what the problem was. Like, I don't know, like, why she just stopped talking to me. Mm. But um, she just did. And then when I would send messages or call her, she would ignore my calls. And then sometimes she would answer, and it would be like talking like nothing is wrong with us. And then when I would hang up, I will hear it throughout the family, like there's an issue. But I was like, what is the issue? You know what I'm saying? I haven't well. did anything. So I just want to really... You know, that word, you know, I, it, you know, I'm always mm-hmm. on the prayer, on the calls, but that right there, when you said that, that was brought back up in my spirit, and I really wanted to um, testify on that, that, mm-hmm. you know, God is. He's restoring unusual relationships and, you know, broken relationships in family because I've yeah. been praying for her because she's been heavy on me. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. She's not my enemy. I know they say pray for your enemy. She's not my enemy. I don't have any animosity to my sister. I love my sister, you know? Yeah. I know things could be better in her life. I know she has great expectations for herself. And um, I know some things in our family is not perfect. We came out a jacked up household. But I believe God going to restore the whole entire family. Yeah. And if he need to use me to do it, he can use me. And I'll take all the cuts, stabs, or whatever I need to take so that people could be free, you know? Yeah. So um, I just wanted to testify on that. Amen, and thank you for testifying. That, that's encouraging. Amen, and just to let, uh, you know, uh, just to confirm the words that go forth, because sometimes you call out words and nobody responds, and then sometimes maybe the next day they be like, that was for me, you know, and then some people are like, well, why you didn't say anything, you know, and they missed that moment, you know. Um, so thank you for testifying. I, God is good. He is so good, and that's, that's beautiful. I, I remember he said uh, if he had... Maybe not, I don't like to say baby mama, but that's what I heard, baby mama drama, baby daddy drama, you know, that he's going to uh, bring peace in those relationships. Um, so I'm excited uh, just to see what God does, you know, because I know sometimes those relationships can be stressful, you know. Does anybody else have anything? Excuse me, prophetess. Hey, good evening. Hi, um, I've been trying to talk to you for a while. My name is Danae. Um, I've, I've, like, since I was little, I haven't had a good immune system. I always get bad sinus infections. I'm always tired. And I don't think it's just, um, my immune system. I think it's something going on that, like, all through my life, something's been hindering me. And, yeah. Let me ask you this. Have you ever got a, a, a diagnosis of, like, lupus or anything? Um, No, mono, but I've only been with two people in my whole life. No, I said, I said lupus. Not lupus, no. Okay. I don't, I don't know why I keep hearing that, but, Father God, we just break. Lord God, any autoimmune diseases. Lord God, we come against uh, just any sickness in her body. God, anything that's coming against her sinuses. We come against that now in the name of Jesus. And, God, we send forth the fire of God right now to touch her from her head down to her feet. And, God, we command her sinuses to clear up right now in Jesus' name. And we break the cycle of just reoccurring sicknesses right now in the name of Jesus. We break that cycle right now in Jesus' name. Oh, God, I thank you, Father God, that, Lord, that she will get uh just clarity in her mind, God. I thank you, God, that healing is her portion. Right now, we bind up the strong man of affirmity right now in the name of Jesus. And, God, I thank you that you will touch her, God, right now in Jesus' name. And 
God, just break through in every area of her life. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. Happy Sam. Yes. Um, can you pray for uh Pastor Jones? She uh has been on your line for a few months now listening in. Yeah. Her son is uh in the hospital. His name is Michael and uh she said he has some bleeding like in his nose. Mm-hmm. They had a tooth running through and he also has a heart condition and they can't stop the bleeding. And then yeah. I'm at the E R right now with my little cousin, uh, and I want to lift him in for his name is uh, Devante, Devondre, I'm sorry. Devondre, yes, okay. And uh, he got mad in school and he punched the wall and hurt his hand, so we want to lift him in prayer as well, if you don't mind. Thank you. Yes, let's, let's pray for his, uh, uh, Prophetess Jones and uh, Coretta uh, De- 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 Devante. Lord God, we pray right now, God, uh, Prophetess Jones, her family, Lord God, we just speak a miracle of healing, Lord, in this circumstance right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, Mm -hmm. we speak to that heart murmur. God, we thank you, Father God, Lord, for a normal functioning heart right now. Lord, we command every issue of blood to cease right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, by your stripes, we decree and declare this child will be healed. Right now, in the name of Jesus, and God, we thank you, Father God, for a miracle of healing right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, we thank you, Lord God, that the enemy has to flee right now in the name of Jesus. You have given us authority over all unclean spirits, Lord, so we walk in that authority now. We command healing right now to function, uh, the heart to function right now in the name of Jesus. We speak for a normal heart rate, Lord God, any hole in the heart to close right now in Jesus' name. God, any issue of blood, we command the bleeding to stop in the name of Jesus out of uh, this child's ear in the name of Jesus. And we thank you, God, for a miraculous turnaround now. We lift up Devontae. Lord God, we thank you, God, for wisdom. God, we come against bullying and any attacks against his life. And God, we thank you, Father God, for healing in his hands. Right now, in the name of Jesus, and God, we thank you that you will restore his hand right now, and that we, we pray that no bones are broken, Lord God. And I thank you, Father God, for this touching this uh, th- uh, this child in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. Did anyone else that we called out something today? Amen. Um, Prophet, this is yes. the bond of um, did you call out work with Pop? Um, I'm, not sure. I'm not sure. Oh, you said I did? Yeah, you did. <laughs> okay. And um, on yesterday, I was, and I was sitting on this since I got terminated, um, and I was kind of reluctant to move forward with, um, it, it, I guess it's compensation. I don't know. Um, it's called a medical um, early um, medical retirement since I was working for the federal government. Um, and my termination uh, was due to um, me not being able to um, see clearly because my, my job consists of reading and writing all day on the computer. So my performance went down. But um, they had an option where you can do medical um, early medical retirement and I sat on that for like a while but I did investigate while I was working uh, what what I must do and everything so yesterday I went and then so I have to file the papers at SSI as well so um, that's what I'm it, it, it's compensation because I worked um, for them for uh, all these years, I had good sight going in, and now my sight is kind of, you know, um, not like it used to be. So I'm just keeping God on that. Let's, let's pray for your sight. Yeah. And then pray for you to get back pay and complicated. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we just lift up this woman of God right now in the name of Jesus. And God, we just come against every attack right now on her finances. 
Oh, God, we just pray right now, God, for healing in her sight. Oh, God, it is not your will, God, for us to deal with blindness or lack of vision. It is not your will, God. Oh, God, when uh, Moses was uh, taken home, God, to be with you, Lord, he, he, Lord God, his his eyesight was not dim. So, God, it is not your will for us to uh, lose our sight. The devil is a liar. We bind up any strong man of infirmity uh, that's attacking her vision. We come against blindness in the name of Jesus. Any odd conditions and diseases, we curse it at the root. And we say, by yes. your stripes, God, she is healed right now in the name of Jesus. God, we decree and declare that you will restore her sight right now. God, you will supernaturally restore her sight right now in the name of Jesus. And, God, we thank you, God. Oh, God, that everything that she has lost, that you're going to restore double, God. And, God, we know that you are her provider. God, you are her provider, and you are making a way for her out of no way. You are making a way, God, for her out of no way. So, God, we thank you, God. God, for compensation, God, with anything that's held up, any finances that are held up, we command it to be loose right now. Loose right now. And, God, we thank you that finances will fall into her, to her bosom right now. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. 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 Thank you. Amen. And just know that God has you. He has you. Amen. amen. And every, I decree this in each and every one of our lives, every injustice against us, God is going to right it. Amen. Hallelujah. Some of yes. us got some yes. injustice against yes. us, things mm. that happen, you know, unfairly. Some of us just went through some stuff, and we face things. But we're, we're doing the right thing, but the wrong things happen to us. Just know that God has us. Amen? Amen. So God's going to take care of each and every one of us. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. You're being Amen. encouraged. Amen. Hallelujah. So, Amen. Amen. I want to encourage you guys to keep expecting. Amen. Uh, I, I speak strength into you. I speak life over any dead dream, any dead organization. I speak life into it in the name of Jesus. Mm-hmm. I speak an outpouring of God's spirit upon you, a greater measure of anointing upon your life. Amen. Mm-hmm. You be expecting. I got to go get some work done. Amen. Um, I want you guys to meet me at 6 o'clock tomorrow for the Tongues of Fire. We pray at 6 every morning. Uh, at noon, we pray again at noon. Amen. Please go and listen to the replay. Amen. If you yeah. are working a job that is uh, – not not favorable for you or it's hard to work there. Well, I speak a miracle in your job situation. In yeah. Jesus' mighty name, amen. Mm-hmm. If you want to bless the ministry, go to my website, prophetisk.org, cash app, dollar sign, prophetis Kim. Uh, sign up for the School of the Prophets. Class start next month. Uh, next month on the 19th, on a Saturday, I'll be in Grow Town, Georgia, for a women's lunch and empowerment. Amen. It's going to be an awesome time in the Lord. Amen. Just know that no weapon born against you will prosper. I don't care how it looks like. Amen. You're going to get victory. You are victorious already. I don't care what it looks like. God's going to pull you up out, and God's going to redeem you and bless your socks off. All right. So y'all have a good day. I'm getting ready to go. God bless. God bless you. God bless.